what I'm wondering for you as a guitar player, what has changed for you um, as far as how you have to approach the instrument now versus before? Is it more challenging now, less challenging? Do you think about it? Like, is it different? Um, not really. Honestly, like I've always had the same approach about writing music. Like when I get into that writing mode, it's just whatever comes out and I think is good enough to keep and present to the other guys, then I will keep that stuff. And there's no, it's not really a preconceived thing, you know, just w what comes out comes out. There's no pre-planning of like, all right, I'm going to write a slow song or I'm going to write a fast song. I just start playing guitar and then start shaping riffs. And then when I think I have stuff that's good enough and I have enough riffs to build the song on, that's where I start, you know, showing it to the other guys in a demo form. Yeah, it makes sense. So do you, how do you document these? Or like how long does it usually take before you get to that point? Is it like you're working on riffs over the period of like a year or is it like a day thing? Like today I came up with like all these riffs that are like worthy of a song uh, show it to the guys. Like is there a general timeline or no rules? Uh, well, generally, like when we are touring a lot, we're not in writing mode. So we're just like focused on, OK, let's just, you know, rehearse the set that we're going to play and do all the shows that we have coming up. And um, I mean, if if one of us is inspired to start working on new material, of course, that happens in between tours and whatnot. But for the most part, at least for me, um, and I think for the other guys as well, we wait until we know that we're going to have a long break, like usually after a tour cycle. And that's when we get into, you know, we're out of touring mode and then now we're getting into writing mode. And then that's where I'll just start, you know, just getting in my room and start playing guitar, come up with some parts and kind of work on fine tune them until I think that they're acceptable enough to use in a song. Then when I get that good handful of riffs, like I said, then it, it, it'll be enough to start working on putting a song together with Paul in the practice room. And then um, I'd say like giving it a time frame. You know, on average, if I'm like, okay, I got to get started on writing a new song, it'll usually take me about a week, you know, like yeah. I'll get in the room and I'll play guitar for a couple hours, try and come up with like a riff that's acceptable. If I would need to change it a little, I'll change it a little and then, you know, get back in there several hours later I'll just go a couple hours at a time unless I'm really on a roll and I feel like I have something that's worth, you know, continuing work on. And sometimes it flows. Sometimes you know when to give it a break. But for the most part, I could have enough riffs for a song within a week, sometimes two, three days. It depends on how quickly it comes out, really. Yeah, it makes sense. 